So, hey, I'm just going to start talking. I don't like the way I sound on video. I don't like the way I look on video, but uh, I want to get comfortable with this. So I'm going to talk my talk, coach myself through this process um, and try to get some some good footage here and uh, talk about this last year. Talk about uh, the things that I've learned. Um, yeah, uh, I think one of the biggest changes that I've had to work through is coming to believe that I have something to offer the market. Um, yeah, it's I can be a technician, an electrician. I can go and, and accomplish almost any task for, for my clients. But to really begin to put myself out there as an expert in the market, as someone not only that deserves to be there, but someone um, that everyone should use. And beginning to have that kind of internal clarity about who I am as a person, as the kind of skills that I have, and now beginning to market them. Wow, that's that's big for me. Like moving from that place of just a lack of confidence to a place of real confidence as a leader. And that confidence is beginning to um, display itself in my business in the way that I um, try to get my employees by leading them onto, a, onto the same page, onto the same mission and um, getting them to go with me to this place that I want us to go, you know, so that's, that's a crazy transformation in my heart. A. David has really like put his finger right on that problem area in me and just kept his finger there. And it's, it's been painful at times, quite honestly, you know, kind of acknowledging some of the fear that was inside of me that I needed to just root out and crush and move forward. Um, so October 1st, we've kind of given as a, a, a the, the day when I start my new job in the business, which is I'm no longer going to be on the tools and I'm going to be working as the as an entrepreneur and not just a technician anymore. Um, I, I realize like I can I can fill an eight hour day or more all week just marketing and that isn't that isn't something i i understood i couldn't have given you a to-do list that i would have worked on um before now uh if i were to be in the office and to begin to realize like wow there is so much um so many ways that i can really begin to put myself out there and meet clients prospective clients um and grow my business. So, uh, if, if you're on the fence about working with a David, let me try to kick you off the fence. It's not, you're not going to regret it. Um, you may hurt a little bit at times. Uh, you may, uh, wonder what the heck you're doing, but don't we all, um, as entrepreneurs feel that at times, like, and we just have to keep pushing. We have to work through our fears. We have to work through our, our limiting beliefs and the ways that we sabotage ourselves and learn and grow. And a David is really going to help you with that. So best of luck. Have a great weekend.